now in this w english program if i check for memory leakage suppose suppose i compile the program and i say valgrind dot slash a dot out then it is showing me memory leakage of 48 bytes so so there is a memory leakage but it should not be there so actually what should happen when this object l1 goes out of scope then the then all the nodes of the linked list should be deleted automatically so for that in the class w linked list i have to write the destructor so here i will write the destructor which is the last function in this w linked list program so i will write the destructor at the end so suppose i write it here so w linked list scope solution tiled w linked list now in the destructor i am supposed to delete each and every node so what i will do again i will take one trap pointer which will be initially pointing to the head after that i will write some while loop in which i will delete that i will delete the trap pointer but before that i have to take the head to the next node so i will say head equals to head arrow get next generally we do not change the values of head and tail but this is the destructor which is which is which, which will get called at the end so that is okay if i change the head over here in this function so head equals to head arrow get next and after that i will say delete trap so what will condition so this will this will delete the node so here one more statement i have to write trav equals to head so what i am doing first i am assigning the value of head to trav then head is going ahead and then i am deleting the trav pointer so this thing will repeat so till what it will repeat till head not equals to null now now let's check if there is a memory leakage i guess now there should not be any memory leakage so if i compile it and now if i say valgrind dot slash a dot out then you will see that there is no memory leakage all heap blocks were freed no leaks are possible so this will be the definition of the destructor function for w linked list class so thanks for watching the video and please do subscribe